it's probably hour and two, hour and a half. Mostly because it's back roads. Yeah. Or a two lane road to get there. But, um, yeah, your property goes all the way down through here. And I believe the end it's, ends about through here somewhere. I think. Okay. Yeah. Around here, they all the old surveys was, uh, they would use, they would landmark everything. They wouldn't use stakes. Like they would use a rock or a big maple tree. Uh huh. Or something like that. Like your car's working to get up this oh, hill. Yeah. <laughs> So if I built this lower land, this would be the entrance to the this lower. This would be the road you take to get your house. And then you'll really like the gravel road to go on and on. Which is not long gravel road, and it's a well-maintained one also. Is it just like crush and run? What? Is it just like crush and run? Kinda. Yeah, yeah see they're about to, uh, luckily it's late May which is never most hay fields start to get mowed. Uh -huh. So you will start to smell like wheat and grass and everything. I mean, there's a lot of honey softball around here. And you know, wow. you, you can be right down the windows and you'll smell, smell it. it. It's sweet. Uh, and the state bird is a, a red cardinal. Okay. And there's tons of them. Really? Yeah. And they're as red as red gets. Yeah. People have little homes through here. Here's oh, lake. look at this lake. Yeah, this farmhouse is beautiful. It's wow. right on the lake. It's a gravel road, but it's still smooth. Oh, this is much better than Crush and Run. This is like asphalt gravel. Kinda, yeah. Of course, it's been packed down so yep. much. It's got tar in it. I feel 
feel bad for your car. <laughs> nah, I'm gonna slow it. It's used to it. I'm sure it is. foot right away going to it and one more tree has fell since I've been here last <laughs> 